Hello and welcome back to Just Get a Tesla. Um, I want to explore something that I've just seen on Facebook. So I use the theatre mode quite a lot. Um, so if I'm parked up supercharging, I quite often go onto YouTube more than I do Netflix or Disney Plus because I'm not watching something particularly long and I can go along and I can start watching uh, videos about Teslas as an example. Um, but what else is there? So what I've seen is that if we search for a better theatre, and I th yeah, it's spelt the American way, of course it is, but if we search for a better theatre, we find ooh, this. Now then, how do I make the browser go full screen? But suddenly, oh, there we go, full screen. Hmm? Redirecting once loaded, click go to site. Uh, don't show this again. Oh, okay, there we go. Uh, yes, go to the site. Okie dokie. So, suddenly, we have got a whole load of entertainment that's come up. So, first of all, I am going to have a look at... Ooh, hang on a second. First of all, let's have a look, do a comparison of what, for example, YouTube looks like if you're doing it through the browser. So... Uh, let's stick on Blackadder because Blackadder is always good. Say hello to the first ever Google Pixel Watch. Track That's very loud. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry if that just blew your uh, eardrums out if you're listening on headphones. Well, that's playing quite well, actually. So, quality looks good. And I just want to double check that I can watch this in... Yeah, I can go to 1080p full screen. So, this is YouTube. And it's watching YouTube as um, full screen, 1080p, whatever you want. Okay. Let's see what else there is. So, go back again. Let's keep going back. Okay. Um, I don't actually have subscriptions to most of these because... Um, if you're watching in America, you might be thinking, well, why haven't you got Hulu and, and Peacock? Whereas here in the United Kingdom, I ain't got a clue what any of those things are. We simply don't have them. But what looks more interesting down here is I can see what these symbols are here. So that is a better root planner. Let's see what this does, because I use better root planner a lot. I suspect quite a lot of you uh, with EVs use a better root planner. Uh because it's a great way of navigating your way around. Right, a better route planner wants to know your location on every visit. Yes, we want to do that. Uh, okay, so we've got to set all of this. Tesla, obviously, Model Y, 2022, and it's with the uh, long range with the NCA battery. Uh, I usually go from 90%. So my position to, let's say I am going to... London, which I've done quite a few times recently. Let's just stick in London and see what it comes up with. So, a better route planner on screen in Tesla, that is going to be very, very, very useful because at the moment I am doing that uh, on a phone uh, or on my computer and then uh, getting into the car. That is, of course, I'm doing that uh, in between going onto YouTube Studio and looking at uh, comments and things that I'm getting on my video. So please do f like and subscribe. Subscribe, subscribe. Uh, I need more subscribers. The more subscribers I get, the more videos that I can do. Okay, um, we will let a better route planner do its thing because I know it calculates a bit in the background. The point is, that at least is there. Uh, Google Maps? Can we have Google Maps now on screen? This is interesting. We can as well. Okay, so this this is really this is really useful. Uh, can we do? Yes, we can. We can do layers. So I can put uh, satellite on here. I can put terrain on here. This is absolutely brilliant. So this is uh, the part of Scotland where I live. It's a little bit slow updating some of this. Which, if you are unfamiliar, so. Obviously, here is Scotland, and I do feel like the weatherman now, but here is Scotland, and I live... <laughs> it's not updated, uh, all of the uh, locations and things, but I live up here, uh, where the sea is on there, um, which is well north of Aberdeen. 
uh, and a long way north of Edinburgh. And it actually takes four and a half hours to drive from my house to cross the border back into England. That's how far north in Scotland we actually live. But this is going to be really, really, really useful. What else have we got? Oh, it's gone, it's gone, it's gone. A better theatre. Okay, so first of all, we need to actually cancel. We're going to go into a better theatre. And then we're going to save it. A better theatre.com adds two favourites. Oh, yes. Um, already, I know that this is going to be something that I use a lot. So is this something that you've been using um, yourselves already? Um, is this something that um, I should have known about already and I'm really an idiot that I... Uh, didn't do either way tell me in the comments once you've subscribed remember to subscribe um which of these um services should i be looking at getting a subscription to because i know paramount plus uh and hbo max and some of these other things are going to charge i suspect quite a few of them are going to be geo locked as well uh so unless i am powering the car uh, off my phone via a VPN, I suspect I couldn't actually see any of these. But already, Google Maps and a better route planner, uh, I think, are going to be really useful. So just a quick video this time. Um, so I'll see you again very soon. More driving to come. Um, I have got some interesting autopilot experiments on single carriageway roads where we um, push autopilot to the extreme. So uh, keep an eye out for that one, and I'll see you again soon.